Damn dogs. Hello everyone, this is Paul Braswell here with Archer Chat and Chill and Art Health and Healing. Now let me tell you something. You know, I didn't know who the artist was, but I saw these colors and it drew me immediately to this artist's work. And I was thinking to myself, I must get, find out, first of all, find out who he is. And without further ado, baby, here he is. Where'd he go? <laughs> Come tell us who you are. Yeah, my name is Eric Khan, a Kifre. I'm from Nigeria. Oh, okay. So I paint African art. So I, my medium, I use acrylic on canvas. So I love using um, African mask faces to illustrate my content. Also, I'm inspired by my father, who is also a renowned artist. My grandfather, when he, was, when he was alive, he was a sculptor. So if you look at my painting, he has more of um, African tribal mask faces. Okay, so, let's describe one of your pieces here. And tell us about this piece here. This piece we are here is titled Breastfeeding. So it's actually um, nature, mother nature. Like taking care of infants, like the mother taking care of infants from child birth. Oh, so breastfeeding, I love oh. And then this southern mother also uh, feeding this infant. So the green monochrome is actually um, nature. When you look around, we have green nature around. So this and, one go ahead. here is um, is Oba, Oba of Benin. Who said again? Because there's a dog barking, and y'all know I'm not an animal lover. <laughs> go ahead. Oba, Oba of Benin means the king of Benin. Say it again slowly. The king of Benin. And what is it called again? Oba. Okay. O B A. Oba uh, of Benin. Okay. So these are the um, warriors that protect the Oba. Oh, okay. Yeah. And what do you hope the, your art, what kind of effect do you want your art to have on the community? Well, I, um, I want the community to feel the original art from Africa. Oh, also to, why Africa? Because right now, Africa is, um, is a place where majority are going there because of the resources there. And we Africans, we are like trying to put ourselves out there to show our real originality and then let them appreciate our talent and our gift also. Oh, let me ask you this. You, you feel that, uh, a question. Do you feel that the Africans appreciate um, art more so than the Americans? Well, um, in general, Americans, they appreciate African art. And then, oh, yes, okay. Yes, and then Africans, they try their best. We try our best to push our art out there so Americans, they can see what we have and then they appreciate it and then they love it also, yeah. Okay, with pushing your art out there, how do you push yours out? Well, I have a website, I have a social media, I have... Um, um, Slowly mention <laughs> the name, because you know you were recording and people, you know how... You know, right. Okay. Okay. Uh, you can follow me up on, on my Instagram, which is Ericon Art, Ashta Ericon Art. Mm -hmm. Also, my website is uh, ericonartwork.com. So, you can follow me on social media, which is Instagram and um, also Facebook, also Ericon Artwork. So, uh, Instagram is Ericon Art. Also, oh, you're all on all the social media, and actually, yes. what I'm going to do is because some of it I didn't understand myself. So I'm gonna swing around here to his, um, he has where, he has his information on. So I'm gonna swing around there so you can uh, see his work. And thank you, thank you. artist. Thank wait a minute, you. wait a minute. Eric Khan E. Is yes. that correct? Eric oh, I got it right. Yeah, you got it right. Okay, so I'm gonna swing around. Thank you so much. I'm gonna swing around so y'all can see. Thank you so his, much. Oh, sure, you're welcome. So y'all can see how to get in touch with him. Cause some of it, you know, I didn't understand what he said. But you know, it's his accent, thick accent. So that's how you can get in touch with. I thought it was Farrakhan, but he said Eric Ericon. 